Hello everyone and welcome to the King Abdullah Sports City here in Jeddah, the shining jewel as it's known. I'm Derek Ray and sharing commentary with me as usual is Stuart Robson and we have live Pro League coverage coming right up. Stuart, your expectations? Well, thanks Derek as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, the way they're set up, it's vital that they don't let the opposition switch the play. They must lock them down one side of the pitch, but they should have an advantage in midfield. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And now they get the ball rolling. Tarek Hamed. Promising attack this. Abdulaziz Albishi. A good and fair challenge. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Hamed. Albishi. Being egged on by the crowd. Superb save. Well, he should score, of course, but that's a brilliant save. And taken short. Terrific block. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. They could nudge in front. What a vital intervention. Albishi. Good movement. And he's in. And the keeper has denied him. Well, I've got to say, Derek, he was always in control of that situation. Brilliant stuff. <laughs> Playing it short. Can he convert? And the keeper more than equal to it. Well, they'll try to keep the pressure on in the form of another corner. And over comes the corner. Straight forward for the keeper.
Andre Diogo Poco. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Hamed. Hegazi here. Albishi. You can sense the threat is there. Well, they couldn't keep that sequence going, unfortunately. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Andre Diogo Poco. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. Well, such is the lot of an attacking player. Some days it works for you, on other days, not at all, Stuart. Yeah, their passing hasn't been great but he just hasn't done enough to receive the ball in dangerous areas. He needs to be doing more in and around that penalty box. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Well, foul play, says the referee. He's played it short here. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Al-Shamrani. Tarek Hamed. Well, for power, 10 out of 10. For placement, maybe 8. Well, he's lost it. Setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. Now well, we're into the final half hour. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Well, it petered out. Mohamed Al Sahli. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Must be! And there it is! 1 0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Well, a dramatic moment near the end and that might well be the decider. doing well to keep possession can they find a gap in the defence well I think a classic commentator's curse just then couldn't make the ideal pass but attacking possibilities good work to regain possession racing forward trying to catch them out well, these fans are right behind the team here. Can they get the equaliser, though? 
Very quick thinking there. Romarinho. And here they come, still pressing for an equaliser. It's with Romarinho. Shot attempted. And using his body to good effect. Mohamed Al Sahli. With a textbook interception. Well, the supporters think it's on. An alert piece of defending. Andre Diogo Poco. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. Well, Derek, it was a poor result, but it was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances. Could have gone either way. But in the end, they will be disappointed. Well, Stuart, he really has had a lot to say for himself out on the pitch. Well, I enjoyed watching him today. His work rate, skill and movement were excellent and he fully deserved to score that winning goal.